Let's play the counter puncher style with Kaito, the Pink Rabbit versus his twin in the Tour 8 of Tennis Clash, a sports game published by Wilder Life Studios. Don't forget to subscribe to the channel Gameplay365 and to turn on the bell if you like this video. Let's start the matches versus Tommy Kanda, the renowned top player. One of the best of this game. He's hitting very hard and accurately and it will be very hard as usual right from the start of the match. So for this match I wanted to see what my pink rabbit could do versus his twin without special string. So I was simply using the Master Monty instead of the Hollow Book Wire or the Koala String. And I was using the Master Monty as well because uh, Tommy Kanda was uh, playing with Cowboy Load while I was using with the Anti Oxidant. So I have a slight stamina advantage in case the match can last long enough. And in that case, well, I wouldn't have a slight advantage in terms of stamina because I wouldn't have a bit more stamina if a rally lasts a bit too long. Then my opponent will lose stamina faster and then I might come back a bit more easily even without the use of a special string. That's why I was using only the Master Monty where he was literally destroying my Kaito with his very hard shots and some very subtle shots to conclude. But his stamina was going down too. And of course I knew that moment would come and I need to be accurate by the end of the match to have a chance to come back because with a lower stamina of course my opponent's Kaito cannot run automatically too fast towards the ball and even if I don't hit very hard shots I still have a chance to hit the winner for the match point on this low serve return, my pink rabbit has been able to outflank his twin to deliver a winner. It was a very lucky comeback once again. This is one of the best players of this game. Here's another one, a top player, an excellent player who beats me very often and well, I'm going to try and survive thanks to the hollow book wire. This is his hard shots. Of course, the hollow book wire gives me the precision whenever I had to counter his powerful backhand. And given my uh, deficit of power, because, uh, well, my swipe is not registered correctly on my Android phone, as I have uh, told you in many videos. Well, this special string is really welcome. We foul its uh, backhand counter and because uh, I can't hit hard shots on my phone, well, it would be impossible, I think, to fight back versus uh, my opponent, who sometimes hits even harder than uh, Tommy Kanda. So, of course, in the first match, you have seen that uh, I have been lucky enough to to get out of the match uh, versus uh, Tommy Kanda alive. But he was uh, using the cover load. And this match is different. My opponent was using the anti oxidants like me. So I knew that I wouldn't have no, absolutely no advantage in terms of stamina, even if the match lasts long. And because uh, my opponent has a stronger backhand of 72, this is my 70 backhand. A backhand stat that I'm trying to improve by upgrading the forge. I'm uh, halfway of uh, maxing out my forge. 55% actually. I still need uh, roughly 139 forge cards. Well, he's having a better backhand stat, slightly better, of two points. So you would say that two points is nothing, but 
in 28 having two extra backhand points is, is a lot it means uh, a lot well to counter that very strong backhand capable of hitting very hard the Hollybook wire was something really useful another top player who has a better forehand start than uh, Tommy Kanda and a slightly better backhand too that's why I was not using the Master Monty I was uh, taking the Harbour Cord which has a forehand counter to compensate for my deficit of power of shots power so he was using the carbo load instead of antioxidants to have a strong forehand and that's why I knew that uh, if I could resist with my pink rabbit running everywhere a bit like that I could try and tie him out a bit playing as a real counter puncher defending a lot letting the hard shots very hard shots of the opponent wash over you waiting for the good opportunity to turn a defensive shot into an offensive one exactly like this one and that is the counter punching style in the real world that will happen like that well in tennis clash Kaito and especially the very powerful Kaitos hitting very hard having very good hand stats I find that they uh, actually using the low serve aggressive baseliner style it's not the counter puncher style anymore they are not defending and waiting to get uh, a good opportunity to counter attack not at all they are attacking all the time actually especially versus players who can't have uh, their swipe registered correctly and uh, that's of course even more difficult for those players to fight back which is my case so actually I have no choice here if I can't hit very hard shots on my Android phone where I know that whenever I enter to 8 with this pink rabbit I need to play the real counter puncher style defending a lot really a lot just to uh, wait to get the uh, the opportunities to, uh, to counter attack that worked in some matches with a bit of luck but not in all and that's why you saw that uh, I drop a bit more than 400 uh, trophies during this session <laughs> with Kaito into 8 it was really hard but at least I could say that I try but that's impossible to play with him in tour 8 not until I uh, play on a, a good device uh, to be able to finally to hit powerful shots all the time so I will still try to uh, to find a way to do something but uh, it will be a very long time before I enter to 8 again with uh, Kaito so in this match is a bit different my opponent had pretty powerful stats was using the same Hollybook wires special string than me but uh, well he didn't have uh, the, uh, the same number of trophies than the other top players that I faced during the three first matches so that might uh, be a bit less tough and you can notice that uh, this opponent was hitting a bit less hard than the three previous uh, top players and that's probably why that was a bit easier for me to counter his shots even if uh, they were hit by a 73 forehand and 73 backhand so they were pretty heavier hands than mine well let's play the last match versus uh, Nepali Racha a very good counter puncher too capable of hitting very hard and knowing that he hits hard well I took uh, no risk 
and use the uh, Hollybook wire to try and counter better his backhand. So now and then his accuracy was not on point, but generally speaking, he was playing pretty accurately. Capable of accelerating the game whenever he wishes to. As for me, same usual stuff. I green it and bear it, waiting to get uh, the good occasion to uh, turn a defensive shot into an offensive one. Doing my counter puncher job, actually. Yeah, really nice acceleration there. He has some admirable backhand shots. And we found a precision uh, low by my backhand counter. I think that would be very, very hard to get out of this match alive. Yeah, nothing we can do here with this parabolic return. Yeah, unbelievable. Sometimes I can hit very accurate corner shots and on the next hit, well, that's a completely failure. Well, it's something that you just need to accept and try to move on. I try not to be disturbed actually by those failures. I know that now and then my finger can respond a weird way and that's it. It's no problem. Just need to stay focused. And move on because the match is still long. So both of us were tied. So that was the good moment to hit a cross court shot. Yeah, that was funny, this <laughs> little bug by the end. A lucky win again. Here's the build and the string that I was using for most of matches in this video. Well, I hope you enjoy watching my Pink Rabbit play the Counter Puncher style versus his twin in the 28 of Tennis Clash, a sports game published by Wildlife Studios. Don't forget to subscribe to the channel Gameplay365 and to turn on the bell to stay tuned for new videos of Tennis Clash. Thank you a lot for your support and see you soon on Gameplay365. Bye bye.